In this video, I will teach you how you can add 3D Asian characters into the viewport in Blender. Now, if you haven't already, you can very easily add Chinese and Japanese characters on Windows. So just go to language settings and then you can add the language and it's even easier on the Mac. And then next, we need to type in the text in an external software. So I'm going to do it in Google Docs. And then I'll just type in something like Chugoku ni itta koto ga arimasu ka? And then as you can see, we get a mix of kanji and hiragana. And then we can copy that text. And we can't add it directly to the text object. So we need to open the text editor. And then click new. And then I'm going to increase the font size so that you can see the texts. And then you can just paste in the text. And then next, go to edit. And then text to 3D objects. And right now you can't see it. And that is because we need to change the uh, font. So let's select a font that supports uh, kanji and uh, hiragana. So uh, the fonts at the bottom usually support. So let's uh, select the human, for example. And as you can see, we now have the uh, characters inside Blender. And then you can add some thickness to it by increasing the extrude value. And now we have three dimensional characters. And for the Chinese characters, we can do the uh, same. I'm just going to uh, remove this text and then switch to uh, Chinese. And then the Chinese text can be something like Dang Ran, Washi, Zhong Guo Ren. And then we can copy that text into the uh, Blender text editor. And then let's remove the uh, previous text and then paste in the uh, Chinese text. And then once again, we go to edit text to 3D objects and then change to a font that supports uh, Chinese characters. And as you can see, we now have both Japanese and uh, Chinese characters inside of Blender.